welcome back to another video. I'm here with the beautiful Stevie Steve. That's me. And we're gonna play Agree to Disagree today as a married couple. I've seen a lot of YouTubers doing it and it looks kind of fun, so. Yeah, I'm ready. And the cool thing is Megan knows all the questions, I don't, so <laughs> I don't know if I should be scared or, or excited about that. I'm the intel here. You ready? Yeah. Question number one. You're ready to move out of Arizona. Did you say strongly agree? Yeah, what'd you do? I said disagree. Disagree? Oh, okay. I, I'm not ready yet. I'm open to the idea. Like we've been talking about it a little bit and I know summers here are just brutal, but I don't think I'm 100% ready yet. I put strongly agree because if I could just move all my friends and everyone yeah. out of Arizona as well, then I'd be out of here in like a second. Yeah. The summers are absolutely brutal. There's so many parts that are just so sketch that you're like, what am I, where do I live right yeah. now? And I miss living in a city. Like I lived in San Francisco, major city. Florida, you drive a little bit and you're in a major city. Yeah. I just miss that. I'm open to it, especially because summers here are so bad, but I'm just not ready yet. Like my whole family's here. I grew up here. I'm just. I need a little more time. Megan has also never experienced anything other than Arizona, so just putting this that out true. there. This is true. I've lived in California, Arizona, Florida. Experienced Tucson. <laughs> oh, God. You do not have to have similar interests to be compatible. I agree with that. I agree with that. I think you have to have similar values, but I don't think you need similar. Like, I, we have different interests and we still get along pretty well. Yeah, like I, I like cool things and Megan just really doesn't. She likes reading and, yep. you know. <laughs> and gardening. And gardening, <laughs> you know. No, like we definitely have similar interests, but at the same time, like we have a lot of differences as well. Yeah. But that's that's cool because then she shows me her yeah. interest, I show her my interest and it works out sometimes. Like Steven's super interested in just going around to car dealerships all day and talking to people and... I like haggling on cars I know yeah. I'm not gonna buy. Yeah. Uh, it's some sick, sick game to me. Being friends with an ex is wrong once you're married. I said disagree. disagree. I, think, I think it just depends on the situation. If it's like an ex who's trying to get you back, then like, yeah, maybe don't be friends with them. But if like, it, it was a mutual amicable breakup, then who cares? Yeah, I think it's, it's circumstantial for sure. Like yeah. if there's still feelings, then yeah, probably you shouldn't do that. And I don't even think like the married thing has to do anything with it. No, I think just like just when you're in another yeah. relationship. But at the same time, like if you guys are cool and you guys are friends, whatever, then whatever. <laughs> Next question. Um, <laughs> Megan starts most of the arguments. Strongly agree. No, I, Strongly. I think your moodiness sets me off. So like, I, I, I start arguing. Pop off, queen. But it's because of you. There's a perfect example. Let's just blaming me for shit. Anyway, I, I, let's move on. No, I think there's a healthy balance between me starting stuff and her starting stuff. And sometimes she's just so like, is amazing and rainbows and butterflies. I'm just like, shut up. up. Yeah, because that's not how I think. Because I, I think realistically and she thinks, it'll be okay. Yeah, I think I'm very, very optimistic. And I think sometimes you want to be pessimistic, so you like don't like it when I'm optimistic. Whatever. But I think Next you've gotten better please. about that. Next question. You're ready to have babies. Ooh, I think. That's awkward. I, mentally, yes, I'm ready and I like can't wait, but I want us to be married for a little bit longer. Like I want to enjoy our married life together before we bring a baby into it. I guess like, yeah. Whatever. Agree I'm ready, but I still want a little more time with just me and you. Sure. What's your take? Do you agree, disagree, what I doesn't, said? Doesn't matter, I've already, I've already <laughs> said if I disagree or disagree. <laughs> I just want more time with you because I- I, I want less time with you, <gasps> which is why I think the baby would be perfect. I have heard from so many people who have babies that like your entire relationship changes, you, you're you not sleeping, you're not spending time together, like your whole life revolves around this new person. But yeah, everyone says like, give give your marriage a year before you have kids and I, I think I want to do that. I just love you so much. Steven is the messier one. <laughs> 
Strongly disagree. Strongly. Here's the thing about Steven. He's neat. He's not clean, he's neat. So he doesn't like to see anything out. So he'll just shove it in a drawer. And here's the thing about Megan. Wait, wait, I'm She's not just done. dirty I'm not done. and not I'm neat. Not done. I love to clean, but I want to clean when I have time to like fully deep clean. So I'll leave things a little bit of mess for a couple of days until I have the time to couple like fully, fully scrub. Megan just everywhere is her closet. So she'll come home and she throws her computer and her bottles and her backpack and her food and her everything all over the communal space. And it drives me nuts. I, I just, I need clean lines. You love nothing. It, he likes it to look like no one lives here. Yeah. Megan spends more money. I knew you were gonna say that. I feel like I'm like more impulsive and frequent with my money spending, but you spend more in the amount. Yes and no, I don't have a choice for a lot of the things that I spend money on because it's like business wise. It's it's for the business. What, what was the amount. amount? No, it was who spends more money. Oh, well, I spend way that's, more that's money. That's what yeah. I was saying. Yeah, you spend more, but I spend more frequently. On rubbish. Anyways, <laughs> going out for girls or boys night is not okay once you're married. You will stay home. <laughs> yeah. Please take so, her. <laughs> Like going out every single night, boys night, that's a little weird. But if it's like every once in a while, you just want to be with your guy friends, that's, I don't care. You trying to tell me something? No, I'm you just want me to stop going I'm out? explaining why I said I disagree. We never go out anyway, so we it doesn't matter. We literally don't do anything. Yeah. We would rather order food in and sit on the couch than go out to dinner with friends. Yeah. We, we love our friends, we just don't like to leave our I house. I don't. Okay. <laughs> you dislike your in-laws. One, two, three. Steven. <laughs> Strongly disagree. Your in-laws are crazy, but my, my in-laws are cool. <laughs> Love mine. If you made it this far, make sure to subscribe to the channel because we are posting one, hopefully two times every single week, and we can't wait to hit 100,000 subscribers. Back to the video. Steven does none of the housework. I would I, say disagree. I think you do, you help, help me with the dishes. I pretty much am the sole one who takes out the trash. Yeah. Yes, 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 yeah. Whether it's necessary or not, I don't know, but she does 7,000 loads of laundry Steven, every single day. Steven goes through so many workout outfits and like I'll wear- One a day. I don't care if this is gross. I'll wear the same workout outfit like two days in a row. Ew. But I don't sweat very much. You sweat a lot. So I understand why you change your clothes. Sounded like a very backhanded thing to say. No, no, no. Like you work out a lot harder no, than I No, it's fine. Like you're disgusting. And that's it. No, I'm just saying you work out a lot harder than I do. Eat your donut. Um, yes, I do. I do most of the house cleaning, I would say. Different responsibilities. Yeah. Couples should share passwords for all their accounts slash to their phones. You ain't touching my bank account, fool. <laughs> no, not like that. It was like social media accounts. I know, I'm kidding. I don't know. Like, I don't feel like I need your password. I'll ask you if I need to see something and you would show me. Would I? You do. Yeah, I think for us too, it's like super different because like this is my work. There's a level of trust. I don't feel like I need to go through your stuff. Mm -hmm. You've never given me a reason to not trust you. Now you on the other hand, I've been waiting for this moment to come up. <laughs> I'm gonna devour that Instagram. Oh yeah? You, yeah. Can, you can go through it if you wanted to. Hey, you're you at like 5,000 followers now. You're growing. Yeah. You shouldn't hang out one-on-one -on -one with someone of the opposite sex if you're in a relationship. I disagree, but not strongly. Like, obviously, it depends on the relationship. But, like, you and Laura, I don't care. You guys can hang out all the time. It doesn't bother me. Again, circumstantial. I, yeah. I think, like, if you're just doing it to do it, then that's kind of weird. But if, like, you have friends who have been your friends or people who you work with, whatever, prior to the relationship, then you're chilling. Yeah. And, yeah, circumstantial. Like, I trust you, so I don't really care if you're alone with a girl. You're not as happy as you look on social media. <laughs> Steven. I am miserable. <laughs> no, I, I would do agree, though. I would definitely oh. agree. Oh, yeah. I think we're very happy. No, we are very happy. Yeah. But I think we've talked about this before. There is definitely times where we go, like we go and we film a video, but right before we're like, <sighs> press record, we're like, what up guys, welcome back to another video. Yes and no, I have a very hard time faking it. Like if I'm so mad you at you. haven't been doing it long enough. Yeah, I, I have a very hard time faking it. So like if I'm quiet, you'll know there's a reason why. But like you, on the other hand, yeah, you're, well, I don't know. Very rarely do I not be able to 
turn it around. Turn it on and turn it yeah. off, yeah. But no, I think for the most part, like what we portray, we are very happy, but of course there's things that you don't see behind, <laughs> behind closed doors. <laughs> Very happy. Yep. 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 We moved too fast in our relationship. Steven. <laughs> <laughs> this is why we can't do challenges like this because you're not honest about anything. I changed my answer. We, d we definitely moved fast. I mean, yeah. we've been together for two and a half, almost three years, and we're married already. But at the end of the day, number one, I feel like that's becoming way more common. I don't feel weird about it. Everybody moves at their own pace. And I quite simply was just, you know, at this point where it was like, she'll do. <gasps> Is that how you really feel? Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, it's not. You chewed on it. <laughs> I can't even like fake sad about that because I know it's not true. We were perfect examples of when you know, you know. Like mm -hmm. it was just very clear that we wanted to be together and we both kind of had our life plans already. We had our shit together. <laughs> One of us did. And it was me. And it was Scout. <laughs> I don't have any regrets about our relationship. I think the only thing I would say is like, I wish we met earlier so we could have gotten our lives started earlier, but at the same time, like the timing was perfect for us, so. All right guys, thanks for watching the video. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to smash that thumbs up button. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Follow Megan on Instagram. Link's gonna be at the top of that description. We're hitting 100,000 subscribers this mother year. So let, sorry, I'm just really passionate about this. And um, we'll see you next time, peace.